and we're out here at the horse farm loading up some more limbs as you can see we've got a lot of these damn trees cleaned up guys we got a lot of them cleaned up we got tyler along for the help today and it's bring your bring your kids to work day for us because it's sunday hey babies are you guys you guys having fun hi what are you doing hello bear come on get over here boy i got some more trees to clean up so i'm gonna get to it y'all get to it it's so nice out here i love this property and it's it's really coming together a lot better ever since uh I've trimmed all these damn trees up. Ellie! Ellie, get over here. She's wandering. Anyways, I'm gonna get to loading this, guy, this stuff up, guys. What's up, y'all? So, we're out at the horse farm and uh, I talked to our clients and they're gonna let us come back and pick up this John Deere mower and uh, we're gonna take it to the to our dealer at Link Salon Equipment and uh, they're gonna give us a quote on how much it's gonna be to fix this up and then we will get the quote to the client and then if it's not too much ask them how much they would take for this Peace. Look at that goofy boy. Oh, by the way, he's goofy. He is goofy. You are goofy boy. You're a goofy boy. A goofy goober. Look at that big old nose. Look at that big old nose. Look at that big old nose. Oh, I know. Hey, you calm down. We're about to leave. We about to leave. They've been such good dogs today. Hey, you ready to go? We gotta go dump. It's getting dark. It's getting dark. It's getting dark. And we gotta come back and get that mower. The mower in there, that John Deere. Yeah. We're gonna take it up to Lynx tomorrow to see how much it's gonna be to get it fixed. And if it's not too much, we'll probably end up getting it. That's a good, that's a good 48 incher mower. Oh yeah. And if we put some new blades on it and get everything changed up and like going the way it should, you know, that'd be a damn good mower for us this summer. I think, well, worst case scenario, if it's not too much, we can always get it fixed up and sell it if we don't like it. If it's not too much. Going to dump. We still got lots to do. There's one. It's the first trailer load for the day. We still got all of this right here to load up. And then in the back 40 out there, we've got a shit ton more to load up. Probably two, three loads out in that field and probably a load or two right out here so anyways stay tuned stay tuned yo 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 my palms are sweaty these weak arms are heavy look at this monstrous pile 
wild. It's a mammoth. This is all from the same job. Literally. Boom. This thing is huge. Well, anyways, I'm waiting until uh, the burn band's up so we can uh, burn it. This is what the homestead's looking like right now, guys. Um, here within uh, this next week or so, I'm renting a little tractor and I'm going to tilt all this up. And then I'm going to come in and use my hands. My dad's going to come over and and help and we're gonna we're gonna hand hand seed this bitch that way we can have some grass this summer and not just these little wild patches anyways guys stay tuned we've got a lot coming here in the next couple months hopefully uh we'll be getting this concrete pad poured soon for our house stay tuned for it peace Hey guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I left this upcoming part in because as a father, this part made me proud. Uh, this dog at the horse farm, uh, the next door neighbor actually, has, had been chasing me up and down that fence in the backyard uh, every time I mowed there. Uh, we thought he was vicious. Uh, JT gave him a chance and turns out he's not so vicious as we've thought all these years. He's just a big puppy dog like the rest of us. What are you hollering at? Hey, hi. Hey, come here. Come here, buddy. Come on, baby. You're so pretty. Hey, it's okay. Come here. Come here, buddy. Hey. Come here. Come here. It's okay, baby. He's a good boy. A good boy. Okay, dude. All right. All right. All right. All right, babe. Okay. This dog is so cool, babe. Okay. All right, well, I'll stop. I'm making my puppy jealous, so I gotta, I gotta get back to work, okay? I gotta get back to work, okay, buddy? Oh, I'm a, I'm a good boy. So you guys may be wondering what's the soft spot then uh, for the boy that was just polite to the dog, that was kind to the dog. Uh, you don't know that dog. That dog has been vicious to me for the last two years. So uh, it made me proud that he was able to get in there and calm him down enough to pet him and love on him. But it really uh, makes a big impression on me when people are like that with animals, when, when they show affection and love for an animal like JT has done with that dog and just about every other animal I've ever seen him interact with. It makes a fella proud because you know if he's treating animals like that, he's gonna treat humans good. And that's all a parent really wants out of their son or daughter is for their son or daughter to treat people nice.